Podcast 35, Student of Life. Awaken the leader inside. Follow the path of leadership. Never give up. Never stop trying. Get up. Believe in yourself. Not every day is going to be easy, but you've got to challenge yourself. You need courage. Be ready. Stop waiting for it to happen. Go make it happen. Harness the power within. You are destined to be a leader. Follow the path of leadership. Awaken the leader inside. Podcast 35, Student of Life. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Dave Rubikov and I'm your host here at Awaken the Leader Inside. Thank you guys for tuning in for another episode. And if this is your first time listening, I appreciate you finding our podcast. And uh, I think you'll learn a lot uh, throughout this show. Uh, so today, you guys, uh, I just want to talk really briefly. You know, every five episodes, we talk about motivation. And I was, I, I was driving today. I was actually driving to work today. It kind of hit me what I think we should talk about. And that is being a student of life. And you're like, David, what does that mean? So let me let me share this with you guys. Life is going to be challenging. And when I'm talking about life, leadership is going to be intertwined with that because I truly, truly believe that your leadership, you know, in the building, outside the building, doesn't matter. Your leadership in life will help shape your decisions. It'll help shape you overcoming hardships and obstacles. And it's woven into the fabric of who you are. So it doesn't matter if it's work, if it's school, if it's life, your leadership is the key component to changing your life. But I'm going to tell you something. Life is difficult. It is challenging. It is filled with hardships, unpredictable obstacles that you will face in your life that will push you to your breaking point. But it's your leadership that will help you overcome that. But I'm going to tell you that throughout my life, I've, I've discovered that the more that I stayed a student, And I'm talking about being active to learn, to grow, to understand my own shortcomings. And this is why I continuously document what's happening to me. And I continuously kind of decompress at the end of the day to look at, man, what did I do great today? And man, there's a few things that I just didn't. What can I do different? And I'm going to tell you that as you stay a student, because just think about it. Students, what do you go to school for? You go to learn. You go, well, most of us go to learn. Sometimes you go to socialize too. But I mean, you're going there to learn something. But when you make a choice, you can, you can continue to grow at an accelerated rate because you want to be there. And so when I think about being a student of life and, and a student of leadership, There really comes down to one thing. Do you really want to be successful? Do you really, really want to grow? And at what cost? And so being a student doesn't happen always inside the four walls of the business that you're in. It doesn't. You know, I read books at home. I read books and I don't read very often. But when something catches my attention that I feel like I need to learn, I will read. I will I will study. I will watch videos. I will invest my time into something that's going to help me grow. So I just want to share something with you. As this show continues to grow, there were so many things that I didn't know. I didn't know how to build a website. I didn't know how to, how to set up the podcast. I didn't know how to do so many different things. But guess what? When I made a choice that I wanted to learn, nothing would get in my way. Nothing. I mean, I spent countless hours reading articles, reading best practices, watching videos on YouTube. I mean, it was obsessive to the point where I actually started learning how to do this stuff. And that was with nobody's assistance. When you get to that stage that you are so hungry to get better at what you're doing, you will go the extra mile. But it comes back to you being a student. How hungry are you to grow? What are you willing to give up to find success in your leadership? What are you willing to give up? As students, think about this. Many of us, yeah, we went to school. and Some of us had to work. But you gave up your time to be somewhere, to learn something, to accomplish a goal like a degree. You sacrificed time 
to make that happen? How much time have you sacrificed for yourself to help you grow? How much time have you sacrificed to, to think about what you can do different? How much time have you sacrificed to write down your goals and write down the things that you're struggling with? Because I'm going to tell you something magical happens when you write things down. And it's almost like you're confronting what's happening to you because in our minds, yeah, we know things, but when you see it on paper, it becomes real. That is something powerful. That is something that students do. They write stuff down. They think about stuff. They dissect information to understand and to better understand how to use that information. This is my challenge to you. This is the next step in you finding the success that you deserve is that you have to be hungry as a student. Now, there are so many people out there that understand this and have been through this and that can help you. This is why I continue to kind of talk about finding a mentor. They are the ones that can help you with this. It's not an easy journey and it's there's it's filled with a lot of ups and downs, but you can do this. I want you to continue to stay hungry. Don't give up. We all hit breaking points when we're on the verge of just saying enough. You have to say, I am not going to give up on this. I am going to continue to fight for this. I'm going to continue to acquire knowledge until I find a solution to find success. Stay hungry. Keep learning and fight for this. This is about life. This is about changing your career. This is about changing your circumstances. Get up and start fighting for what you want. Stop waiting. Go do it and go do it now. If you've enjoyed this episode, please log on to iTunes and leave me a review. Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate it. Stay tuned for the next podcast. Always remember, awaken the leader inside.